What's going on, X-Factors? I'm glad you guys could make it to the garage. Y'all know I'm trying to step the equipment up inside of the garage simply because it's always beautiful out here in Arizona. And at some points of times, we want to get those garage workouts in, especially for the queen because she doesn't always go to the gym. I'm more like, you know, six, seven days out the week, I go to the gym. That, that's just what I do. But for the queen, she actually doesn't go to the gym except for about two or three days on average. So it's good to have some equipment inside the garage simply because me and her both can train i can put her through a decent workout and at times i don't want to go to the gym or i can't make it to the gym i could just train right here so stepping up the equipment in here i got some stuff in here i'm gonna save it for later because this video i want to bring you guys my new toy my newest toy I made my new toys right because it comes in pairs which you probably already know what that is right now but i need you guys to go ahead and subscribe right now if you are new here i promise you you're gonna like this video you're gonna like all the content that i bring to this channel we are growing 14k i think 14.4 almost 14.5 we're getting up there y'all 15k we're gonna do something crazy so y'all stick around for that but share this video we are about to get a killer workout inside the garage strictly dumbbells all right so i gave it away i got some new dumbbells let me show you what i got <laughs> yes sir that's one Ah. Woo. That's two, huh? All right, y'all, here we have it. We have the Ativia Fit dumbbells right here. 88 pound dumbbells, adjustable, you see it right there. I'm gonna go ahead and unbox them for you guys so you can check them out. And then me and the queen gonna get it in. You ready? You got a queen right there, y'all. Gotta put that bugs for you on, man, because it's crazy. I hear these bugs is going crazy. So that's probably one of the downfalls of working out in the garage. Bugs galore. Quick, we get that cardio in first. Get a little warm up, a little slight warm up, nothing too crazy. Now you know you good. It's fitness channel. This is a X Factor fitness channel. All right, y'all, we got some instructions right here. And I'm curious, because instructions for putting together dumbbells, probably just instructionals on how to use the dumbbells. Got the safety locks and all that, so we'll use that later. But what it does have is a nice exercise chart. That's pretty legit. Let you know everything you could be doing with dumbbells in general. Pretty legit, front and back. It's loaded, so we're gonna, we're gonna get it in. Y'all, I've always wanted some adjustable dumbbells and I finally have them. It's like Christmas, baby, let's get it. Got the rack right here. Sit that down right here. Woo, it looks pretty. It's looking pretty, make sure it's locked. Woo. Yeah, that's 88 pounds. Ooh, look at that, right there. That's crazy. All right, y'all, here we go. So we're gonna grab the dumbbells using our knees. We're gonna drop it right in here. Voila. All right, y'all, so what is cool about this right here is that it has a lock piece right here. So this is how you lock it. But it's not just a push the button and it locks or nothing like that. You actually got to hold it down if you want to spin, which is super legit because sometimes this can break, but that's not what we want. So you got to hold it down and you can't turn this until you actually unlock it. So this is like a safety lock. If you look right here, we got 11 to 18. So 11, 18, 11 is the lowest. So what I would have liked on these is for it to be like five and then 10 and then 50, you know, standard that way like that, simply because the queen isn't, you know, as strong yet. So starting off with 11 pounds is uh, pretty intense for certain individuals and it doesn't go any lower. So if you can't lift up 11 pounds, you 
can't use these dumbbells. So I would have liked to see, you know, some fives on there, maybe two and a half, but that probably would have got a little complicated being that it's 88 pounds. I mean, these are pretty heavy. Normally you'll see them going to like 60, you know, or if you spend some real money, you might get a hundred or something like that, but 88, fire. All right, so what we're gonna do, we're doing some lateral raises. So I'm gonna go ahead and crank it to 18. Still getting a nice warm up. And when you turn one, it turns on both sides. So you can just do one side and it's lit. Lit like big. We got two right here. Grip it like that. And we got 18 pound dumbbells right here. All right, y'all, we're doing some overhead tricep extensions with the dumbbell. So I got it on 74 now. So this is pretty much my last working set. But I never recommend this going heavy if you don't have proper form. Because you're going over your head and you're putting your triceps in a, your arms in general in a compromised position. So if you are going to do these, make sure that you go light. But this is legit because it has a nice little circle platform here that I can sit my palms on. The only hard part about adjustable dumbbells is, is the re-rack, because now I got to find the right position for them. And my arm is extremely tired, <laughs> and I got to line it up perfectly. And if you have some regular dumbbells, you just drop them things and keep moving. Well, yeah, we get a nice workout. Good, good. Right, let me show y'all one more thing before I close out. Let me show y'all another benefit to these longer. See these dumbbells, see how long they are? It can get a little awkward, but for the specific exercise that I'm about to do, that's on point. So I don't have an easy bar or anything like that, like a barbell or anything. So I'm going to do curls, look at that. I can just stick them together and they hold pretty nice. Just like that. Nice shoulder width apart. Mosquitoes everywhere, but it's all good. And then, boom. Yeah. Alright y'all, that is it. So this right here, I just wanted to show you guys the, the Tivia Fit Dumbbells. I didn't give you guys the full workout, but you can see me and the queen got right. Well, you can't see the queen, she's behind the camera. But it was a good workout, good little garage workout, guys. Nothing crazy. Every workout doesn't actually have to be in the gym. And I do recommend if you want to go in, you want to really build that muscle, better get your butt in the gym. But at the same time, sometimes you're not able to go to the gym. So having you some equipment at the house is going to be very beneficial. As you see, I'm out of breath, which means, hey, to me, job well done. So y'all go ahead and subscribe. If you haven't subscribed already, check out this video right here. That's going to be a real good one. I don't even like that. And stick around for the next video. Catch you guys in the next one.